Hey guys, um, <laughs> fun morning this morning. Uh, I have a Zoom meeting for knee exercises pre and after your uh, operations on Zoom. And um, I tried my darndest to try to get hooked up to it this morning. I was like 10 minutes away, got it all set up, hit the link. Sorry, this link is for February 17th. <laughs> so I ended up phoning them and um, found out my appointment was for March the 3rd. And actually today's session was at 2.30, not 10.30 a.m. I'm like, oh my goodness. So I'm trying to hook up Wi-Fi booster from the shop so I can get it back here. And uh, I'm having issues with that too, so... Not a very productive day this morning, but it is fairly cold. We have beautiful blue skies here, which means there's nothing holding the temperatures in. So we're going to get out there shortly. And uh, I can't remember what I'm doing today. I'll pull up the to-do list. Anyways, that's my morning. Um, I'm going to play with this a little bit longer and then we'll get on to something. Okay. I'll talk to you in a bit. So it turned out we didn't get on to anything. Uh, it's not dark out. I was uh, in the shop and uh, was telling the owner about how crappy of a sleep I had. He goes, maybe you should sleep during the day instead of the night. <laughs> yeah, so uh, I did. <laughs> Actually, I think I needed to catch up on some sleep. But... Um, it's minus four outside. So I think today we'll focus on uh, finishing up some of these uh, window tiles. I have a new plan for them, so. They're okay, but they seem to be a little bit floppy. Oh, come on. Come on. Here you go. Big stretch. Does that sound like a plan? Just hang out in here for a while. You still have to build your um, sitting station. But that would mean we have to go outside where it's cold out. And you'd rather be in bed, wouldn't you? Okay, I'm going to clean up around here and get to work. So, yeah, see how these things bop out eh this one actually is a real nice tight fitting one but even it as it gets warm in here they want to buckle out so this is our plan i was going to run velcro all the way up to here the other window this one here slides down the outside and that would keep the whole bottom end secured but then i thought well all i need is Probably a piece here and a piece here. So there's the next piece I'm going to put on. I'm going to see if it works. Well, my friends of YouTube, the production has started and <laughs> the camera is just being pulled out. I know. I almost got everything pulled out of here. I've been uh, trying to get everything out of the back of this van and get it into this van and we have already fixed that van <laughs> is that enough vans anyways I'm liking how things are fitting in here very nicely uh, let's see what we did in the house the house the condo I did a bit of a cleanup, not much, but we're trying to clean up here to get all the guppy stuff off and it seems to be coming and uh, yeah, it's a start to give me an idea of how things are going to work. You might like this too, my little stopper rail, 
that's uh, going to keep the boxes in when we drive. So things are coming along pretty good. Uh, it is uh, the weekend coming up, so we're going to get things cleaned up around here and uh, hopefully, hopefully get out this weekend and do something crazy. Okay, I'm going to clean up this mess. Yep, I'm pretty happy. Can't find these. Uh, that's gonna be sometime in the future. I just found that. So we'll have that up maybe tomorrow. Started that. Bam. Um, yeah, the organizing the garage came along really good. But this is the best part. We have Russell underneath here. He's doing a tune-up. <laughs> putting new plugs in and we replaced a uh, some kind of sensor thing. Fuel temp sensor. Fuel temp sensor, that thing right there. Yeah. Cool. Let's we'll see how this baby runs. Get it ready for Hollywood. Okay, we're not going to Hollywood. <laughs> how was your supper? Was it good? I have to go visit um, Richard, your buddy. And I'm going to go for dinner with him. Do you want to go for a car ride? Is it not amazing how uh, <laughs> dogs know words? Anyways, we're just sitting here in the van or the bus. Finished feeding the dog and now uh, I'm going to... Uh, Take off and go feed myself. Let's go see how they're doing. <laughs> Got the Goldberg sign. <laughs> What's going on, Russell? Let's start it and see if it goes kaboom or not. Okay. Lost my best friend tonight. Life is real. Cooper died last night. She was my everything. I don't even know how I feel. I haven't slept in 12 hours. Blessed with good friends. I found a spot for Goldberg. He'll be going next door to where he was born. My old uh, house. And uh, this neighbor was his best friend because he had the best treats in the neighborhood. And I'm trying to document it because this is real life. This is what happens. Yep. It'll be peaceful under all these evergreens. This was his favorite ball. So I put him to rest with his collar, his ball, 
What's the name tag? And it's Blanky. I'm gonna miss this guy, man. He was my world. Oh my god. nice, eh? It's nice to know that my dog was loved by so many people. Those are all my old neighbors that rallied together and welcomed Goldberg, Goldberg back to the neighborhood. Shared a few stories. I'm gonna miss that little bastard. Oops, I shouldn't swear. Anyways. Thank you all for uh, being a part of my life. Um, I'm going to probably put the camera down for the next while. Um, we'll be back. I just need to recoup and get my plate cleaned. <sighs> Love you guys. I'll see you soon.